Run by Sports, Leicester 0, Arsenal 1, the Arsenal player ratings. Uh, I'm going to run through these quickly. Starting in goal, Aaron Ramsdale. Didn't have nothing to do. Man could have chilled there. Man could have sunbathed. If it was sunny outside, he could have caught a tan. He could have been putting his feet up, sliders on, doing nothing all day. They had nothing. Um, but his distribution was good. Can't give him lower than seven, in my opinion. Uh, we won the game. Ben White. Ben White, people say cost us the goal. But I argue and say, listen, at the end of the day, if he don't hold his hand a bit, like maybe Ward deals with it differently and that ain't a goal. So I don't think you can say he cost us that goal, even though he kind of did. But listen, Ben White has the dark arts in his game and he does it sometimes and it benefits us and we get away with one and sometimes he does it and you get caught out listen it is what it is i'm not going to hold that against him i thought he had a good game um i'm also going to give ben white a seven guy next to him saliba uh solid game from saliba for me i think he made a couple of um interceptions and that were that were top draw um i'm going to give saliba a seven uh there's going to be a lot of sevens today for, because i feel like everyone played good we dominated the game and at the end of the day not many people played above a seven because it weren't that hard a game but not many people played below a seven to be honest so seven's going to be a, a number you're going to hear a lot today <laughs> uh going to his partner uh gabriel uh probably for me joint man of the match um i thought he was i thought it was quality i thought he was doing he done everything right i thought he did put a foot wrong made the blocks when he needed to was making interceptions I give him a nine, to be honest. I give Gabriel a nine. Um, I just thought he just looked like our best player. Like he looked like our best defender. Um, and I'm really struggling with who to give the man a match, but I'm going to give him the same rating. So he gets nine. Um, going to the left back um, position, I'm going to say Zinchenko gets. Zinchenko was good, man. I think he was a lot better than some people want to give him credit for. Um, I'll give Zinchenko a seven. I thought his passing was wicked. Um, he almost could, there was a, a shot again he had, and I think it may have hit the post, or he got blocked. I can't fully remember right now, but uh, he had another one of them shots. He's looking like he was going to score again. I was like, yeah. So seven for Zinchenko going into the midfield. Um, Jorginho. I thought Jorginho had a really good game, man. I thought Jorginho um, on midfield pretty much won everything. So. To be honest, Jorginho, that pass he put through to Saka, I think Saka has to do better. Like, he cut the whole team out. I'm going to give Jorginho a, um, an 8, actually. Uh, I thought he had a really good game. He's doing the dark arts tactics at the end, going down, taking time, slowing the game down. This is the experience that Jorginho brings to the team. Um, guy next to him, Xhaka. Solid game from Xhaka. Back again, Xhaka. Like, he's been a bit quiet the last couple of weeks. Um, looked a bit tired, but today, back again, taking knocks, taking hits, uh, putting his body on the line for the team. I love Xhaka, man. Uh, Xhaka's the biggest U-turn in, 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 in <laughs> uh, maybe in Arsenal history. Um, I'm going to give him an eight as well. Uh, going on the right-hand side, Saka. Saka was quiet today, man. Saka was quiet today. Um... It happens, you know, that right, that left back, that Christensen or whatever for Leicester, he's not a bad little player, actually. Like, he dealt with Saka. I felt like, listen, Saka's been getting the shit kicked out of him game after game. This was a dominant game. We didn't really need Saka to be too influential in this game. Obviously, it would have been nice. He scored, but it was offside. But I'll give Saka a six for his standards. I've got to give Saka a six. On to the left wing. Martinelli with a goal. I'm going to give Martinelli, you know what? I can't give Martinelli too low or too high because for me, he won us the game. But that first half, for me, he wasn't great at all. So I can't give him higher than what I'm going to give him. Um, Martinelli, for me, gets an eight. I'm going to give him an eight. I think that's a fair fair result. He's not the two, there's two players with nine. Um, he's not getting a nine. He's getting an eight. Listen, he scored the goal, won us the game. Cool. That's why you get an eight. And I'm happy and I love Martinelli. He's one of my favourite players for the club. But that first half performance for me was like a three or a two. So when you've been like that half on the player ratings, you can't go too high. So I'm going to give him an eight. Uh, in the middle, Aldegaard. 
I didn't think Aldegaard had the greatest game. There was a bit where he was like on the break, and you're like, Aldegaard's going to do something here, and he sort of he sort of loses it. He sort of loses it in his feet and and loses the ball, and I'm like, what's going on with Aldegaard, man? Um, but listen, everyone's due to have one of them games, and that is what it is. I give Aldegaard a six. Um, Trossard up front. I used to hate that celebration before he joined us. Now I love it. <laughs> um, Trossard, goal. Sad that it didn't stand because it was a beauty. Um, shows what he can bring to the team. Him playing up that up front, you know, I re I'm, I'm really liking the look of that. And I feel like that might be what we have to go with until Jesus is back for now. Maybe uh, him and Eddie can rotate. But I think that... Um, that that's a that's maybe what we have to go with in the next game against Everton. Um, yeah, did I say nine? Did I say nine for Trossard? He gets a nine. Um, but that that assist as well, that assist alone, man, was so beautiful, man. But he it was everything he was doing. He, he had a really good game. Nine for all the god. Uh, the subs that come on, I'm going to rattle through these. Um, Thomas Party shored it up. Six standard. Um, weren't on for that long, but he shored it up, so I'll give him a six. Eddie and Ket, yeah, come on, done what you had to do, pressing, working hard, see it out the game. Eddie and Ketia also gets a six. Um, Tommy Asu just come on to bring someone on, waste a bit of time, get a bit more so solidarity on the pitch. I'll give him a six as well. Uh, I believe that's everyone that come on. I believe that's it. If I've forgotten anyone, I feel really bad. I, feel, oh, I can't even check right now, but. No one else come on for me. Uh, I don't think. No, I think that was all. So, <laughs> uh, Arteta. What can I say? I think I'm going to give Arteta a nine. Um, I'd normally do the ref first, but I'm leaving the ref till last. Uh, Arteta gets a nine um, for me because he seemed to have weathered this storm. He changed the starting lineup. It worked. Dominated the game. We weren't getting a goal. He obviously said something to these guys at halftime because they come on. The second half and they started so fire that and we got the goal so nine for arteta on to the referee this pussy oh i'm not gonna lie to you yeah i thought he was fucking shit yeah i'm not gonna get onto him for the for the disallowed goal i'm not even gonna get onto him too much for the penalty that we should have had yeah because i think they're more var stuff but the fact that none of their players maybe one right near the end but none of their players got yellow carded they were kicking the shit out of us. They were taking us out, left, right and centre. No yellow cards. Martinelli does one little foul. That weren't even a bad foul. Yellow card. Nah, man, this ref is a prick. Minus 10 for this ref, man. Minus 10 for the ref in the game, man. I fucking... These refs, man, they piss me off. Even though we won the game, I'm cussing the ref. Why do I have to do that? I shouldn't have to do that. Um, but yeah, that's the player ratings. Like, comment, subscribe. Comment below if you agree or disagree with my player ratings and what you would have given the players and, and stuff. Uh, yeah. I'm by Sports. Peace.